Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Rome, and I've just got a quick one today about some of kind of the seasonal mechanics for the, the, the season of escalation um, that have been I've been struggling with as we played through, or I've been I, I've finally done some research, is what I'm trying to say. So, first one one that I've really paid much attention to, we've looked at it a little bit here and there, are we get these enchantments. Now, um, as you initially play the game, these will unlock as you kill monsters, and they will update as you kill monsters. Um, the type of enchantment you get is based on the type of slot. You've got two primary slots, the two blue ones at the top, a secondary, um, a relic, an archaeotech, and um, another uh, whatever. That's the type that would be like on a regular equipment type of stuff. I can't think of what it's called off the top of my head. If one of these you really like, you can lock them. So, for instance, um, I happen to have a couple of locks. Now, um, I really kind of like, I think it's that Archaeotech one. Let's take a look. It is, yeah, gain three faith per kill while Embodied Saint form, because obviously Embodied Saint um, kicks down um, like one second per faith or something like that. So the more faith you have, the longer Embodied Saint works, but you're not generating faith while you're in Embodied Saint. So if you can generate faith while you're in it, then you have a better chance of keep, well, then you will keep the Embodied Saint going longer, right? So let's go ahead and let's go ahead quickly. And I've got two of these anyway, and we just locked one. So now if we come over here, you can see I've got an Archaeotech Enchant locked. That will last for five minutes. Now I believe you can only have one locked at a time. So I lock something else. It will overwrite this. You should be able to also purchase these, I believe, from Ragna. Um, tarot Seals. Here we go. Yep, right there. So you can purchase those from her as well. So um, the other thing is, as we do these missions, we're going to get various bits of Escalation Currency here, which is the Harbinger badge. Um, and you can see those will let us buy those. Now, what are the Harbingers? The Harbingers happen to be um, villains and commanders in the game that have a chance to become a, har a Harbinger. Harbinger, excuse me. Um, Harbingers have a horde around them. And so when you have that horde going, uh, each horde member adds 50% hit points to the main boss. So you want to kill all of the horde, and then you can kill him. Um, killing them is going to give you these Harbinger, Harbinger badges, as well as potentially drop, I'm going to say potentially, um, uh, keys of escalation. And if you go in here and you check, you can see how many keys of escalation you have. So I have a single escalation key cash key and there's a void key of escalation you can only have one of those at a time it says um, we've got one of these now we've only seen two of these drop so far i don't know if that means i've only seen two harbingers or if that means that uh there's only a chance that they'll drop those and and mine just haven't been you know what i'm saying um we'll have to kind of uh play that by ear and see as we, we figure it out but uh so that's how we get the cash keys and that's how we get the currency. Now, um, mine happens to say that 333 Harbingers have been eliminated. <laughs> um, I haven't killed 333. Like I said, to the best of my knowledge, maybe I've killed two. Now, they, these, I believe, in your random missions have a much higher chance of being in there. You're likely to see many more of them. Uh, they also have an aura that buffs their allies as well. So, um, so anyway, so you wanna kill the Harbingers, that gets you the keys, that gets you into the chests. Uh, and then these enchantments can be locked if you need to. So that's that's uh, the seasonal enchantments and uh, chests and harbingers to an extent. So thanks for watching, guys. Thumbs up, thumbs down. We'll be back with some more. We'll see you. Cheers.